Okay, I've got a bit of a mess here in my engine bay with these fusible links, not uncommon with cars this age. Um, it's kind of a part right now because I've already looked at what I want to do. And you can somewhat see here that um, two fusible links have been, quote, replaced already. Uh, not very well, I would add. And just for some clarity, what's happening here is that power comes directly out of the battery cable through this six gauge wire. It goes in here and for some reason weaves back up and around to this little octopus guy here. And that supplies power to so many different things. Today we'll look at replacing fusible links with the Little Fuse J case fuse holders. They're time delay like a regular fusible link, but they use a small J case fuse. They come in many varieties. Generally, the 10 gauge unit can do up to 40 amps max and the larger 8 gauge unit can handle 60 amps. While they come with a very nice heat shrink tube on them from the manufacturer, I needed to modify that connection and where that happened I made sure to use some nice dual wall heat shrink tubing. Looking at what came out of the car, I'm sure this will hold up for some time, offer circuit protection, and most importantly, have the car on the road in under an hour. Alright. Not uh, the most factory looking deal. I, I don't really like, care for this right here to be honest with you, but again, for a driver, something I'm just going to, you know, go around in. Um, not bad, and quite frankly, the quality of repair is very decent. Dual wall heat shrink tubing on this, every which place. Um, you know, it, it's going to it's gonna do just fine. I probably will look into getting a new battery terminal for it. I just didn't have one on hand. Otherwise, I probably would have gone with some of the nicer ones I'm using that have got like, uh, I don't know, six or eight spots for the ring terminals to be bolted down. Uh, they're pretty nice. They hold well, and um, you know they do the job. So I'm going to call it quits here. Again, got those new JK fuses there, eh, along with some um, standard ATO fuses that are uh, going to the relays for the headlights. And I think this will be nice. I, if I wanted to, I could gussy it up with a little bit of wire loom or some friction tape. Uh, but we're going to leave it like that for a little while, make sure it works.